Hey guys, Medigazelle back once again to continue Metroid Prime Blind, and I swear, I do not mean to do this. I just kind of like, trying to get my bearings. Um, <laughs> anyway, uh, look at my awesome new suit, as I got in the last episode. Uh, a lot of things that you guys mentioned to me. Uh, one second, I'll go over that in just a moment. It's going to tell me where my thing is again. Yep, and it's in that room. That's fine. Um, someone mentioned that there's actually a morph ball thing behind my ship, uh, where I can find a missile upgrade of some kind. Let's see if I can go find it. Maybe it's in here? Oh, shit. What's the point on that? Just like a weird... shortcut of sorts? I don't know. Um, but yeah, uh, I need to... First of all, there's the puzzle in the Sun Tower that I can go back and do, but I might wait a little bit to do that. Um, hold on. Nope. Okay, well, I'm kind of... I don't really know where to go first. There's a lot of things I want to do. Part of me wants to go looking for, like, power-ups and stuff. Um... But first, I'm going to see if I can find that power-up behind my ship that you guys mentioned. Or one of you mentioned. Behind my ship, huh? Hmm. Sorry if the beginning's a little bit, uh, slow. I'm just trying to... If I can't find it, I feel bad, but, um, we could always try to go, go forward with our adventure and see if I can just run into stuff naturally. That's always a possibility. Alright, well, I'm not getting anywhere, anywhere doing this, so let's go, uh, let's just go on the main adventure. So we're going to want to go down this way. I'm going to start keeping my eye out for more collectibles. You guys have stressed heavily that I should be looking more for them, so I will do my best. So, I'll start by looking in here. Every room, I'll just sort of uh, do my best to scan and look around. Now I'm going to be all cautious and like look in every little nook and cranny. So, I can't, I'm kidding, I'm not going to do that, but... Okay, someone mentioned the ice beam also is good at taking out these guys. Hey, hey! I like that. He uses the missile to kill them, but whatever. Um, let's see. There's gotta be a lot of power-ups in this room as well. Let's see if I can find some. Can't make it up there, I don't think. I'm sure a lot of the stuff will be reachable once I get the grapple hook, so I'm not going to stress too much, but in the meantime, we have to head back to the area that I was at before, but I was just there a little bit too early. I tell you what, the ice beam shoots kind of slowly, but okay, we got to get up there. All right. Um... Well, now that I can move freely through water, it's going to help with this section a lot, I think. I have no idea where, I have no idea where I'm going. Um, okay, you're being annoying. I don't know what, like, sometimes when you're trying to shoot stuff in this game, especially, like, 
the things you may or may not have to log on to. It's kind of annoying. Oh, there's a missile upgrade. Hallelujah. Missile expansion acquired. Uh, as I was saying, I don't like how sometimes you have to log on specifically to certain things. Like, I, I get why they do it in terms of game mechanics, but it's just kind of strange to me that you can fire a missile at something in the exact same spot, but it won't do anything. But if you lock onto it, it will. You know? I don't know. Okay. So according to the map, it's something up there? Like, way up there? Or maybe it's saying this general room. It's probably meaning just the room in general. Uh, regardless, I do think I'm gonna have to make my venture back into this crashed alien ship. Uh, let's see, it's kinda dark. Let's see if I can make my way through here. Did it once before. Now that I can move freely through water, let me see if there's anything I can do down here. Still don't know what the hell this thing is, but I can't scan it. What the hell is that? Some gelatinous monster that died or something, I don't know. If I'm not mistaken, there's turrets behind this door, so let's... murder them. Okay. Um, let's see here. So this is a door. Well, there's no power to the door, so let me scan around the room. For any power conduits or something like that. If I'm not mistaken, we'll probably have to follow the, uh, Hmm. Yeah, nothing up there. Okay, so this room, this room is definitely not where we're supposed to go yet. I know it was in here before, but I don't know if I had, like, if it's something that opened up now that it told me to go here. I don't know. I understand a lot of speedrunners. <clears throat> they use the ball form to get around everywhere very fast. I would do that, but I kind of like walking around in case I don't miss stuff. Because I miss enough stuff as it is, as you guys are uh, telling me. So I just want to make sure I can uh, explore things on my feet. No, no, shoot missiles. Okay, so... Hmm. Jump up there next, probably, yeah. I can't go any higher in this room. Uh, well, maybe it's something out here I missed. You know, I could probably try my thermal view. Maybe I'm missing something with the thermal view. Damn, this is it's kind of dark in here. There we go. I doubt it. I don't think I missed anything, but... Yeah. yeah, just checking. I don't even need to use missiles, I can just keep shooting them with the charge shot of this. Cool. Alright, um, let's see. If I were a secret, where would I be? And the question mark's gone. What the heck? The question mark was there. Now it's just gone. There is a door up there. But I don't think I need the grapple probably to get there. It's like way up there. Hold on, maybe not. Let's try to find let's try to find a way to get up there. 
Maybe it's something to do with the platforms over here. There's a lot of underwater platforming stuff over here. And there's enemies. Huh. A little bit of a pickle that I'm in. Well, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make this episode more of a collectible hunting mission and not main story progression mission. I'm going to go back in areas and try to find various power-ups and stuff. Um, I know that sounds kind of stupid, but I'd rather do that than waste my time trying to find out what the next objective is. I'd rather have you guys uh, tell me a very helpful hint as to where to go next. Because the, the question mark disappeared, first of all, and I didn't know how to get past that door. And I figured it needs power, but I don't see any power conduits anywhere, especially when I scan for them. So, let's go back in here. Let's start looking around for some uh, upgrades. From what you guys say, there's pretty much an upgrade almost in every room, it seems like. So I'm going to try to look around this room first. You guys said the thermal something helps you see them as well? Maybe not. Maybe it's not thermal. Maybe it's the... I don't know. There's a certain way to find them, and I'll just have to discover it. Uh, let's see. I think thermal might be a good place to start. And you guys said to like, listen for stuff. I'm not listening with headphones right now. I'm actually listening through the TV, and uh, I have the volume kind of low, so it doesn't get caught up on my mic. Um, let's see. Still wish I could find that power up behind my ship that someone mentioned. Oh well. Let's just head back. We can also go to the sunroom and do the puzzle in there. Uh, you guys mentioned that you only need three missiles to destroy the, the cracked sections in that sun tower room. And when I looked up a video on someone doing it, honestly, it looked like it took more than three. I took like five regular missiles to destroy it. And I don't know if I'm crazy or if that that guy was just like, I don't know how to glitch version of the game or something. I don't know. But all I know is that was not, uh, that was not, what do you call it? It was not three missiles. That's for sure. So look at this room again. There's something up there. Maybe that's just, oh, it's just that. Just really, but, all right, well, to avoid myself looking like an idiot for any much longer, let's go, uh, let's get out of here. I have no idea how productive this episode's gonna be. Um, at the very least, I think I can solve the puzzle in the Sun Tower room. Okay. Sun Tower, or Tower of Light, that's what it's called, not Sun Tower. I can also try to go find some relics if I really wanted to. I could probably try that as well. Let's see how the Tower of Light goes first. still that power up up there, but I don't know how to reach it. Come at me, bro. Okay, I gotta fire faster to kill this guy. I don't know why I'm fighting this guy. I probably don't need to. I just want to murder him. Getting my nerves. Alright. It's gonna bother me if I leave this missile upgrade out there any longer, but I just don't know how to get up there. It's, it's gotta be the grapple. Alright, let's do one clean sweep of this big room, see if there's any power ups in here.
nothing visible at the moment, but let's get a different vantage point. Bunch of these little bastards again. Get out of here. Die. Yep, just that lone missile upgrade over there that taunts me to this day. All right, let's just let's stop messing around here. Let's go back to the Sun Tower room or the Tower of Light. I don't know why I keep calling it Sun Tower. Tower of Light. Damn it, these guys spawn back. Damn it, okay. Alright, well, hold on. You know what? No, you guys are gonna die. Can't use any misses on them because I need that for the next room. Boop. And you're dead. Let's get your friend. I really do hate these enemies. Oh my god, I hate you, I hate you, just... I wish these guys would stop spawning in these rooms, to be honest. There. The worst part about it is it makes my screen very dark, so it's hard to, like, just zip past them, because I need to do this thing. Can't do this very well if I can't see. Okay, so here we are. Once again, the Tower of Light. Third time's a charm, as they say. I'm gonna show you guys... Okay, so you guys said three missiles. You said three. So let's see, let's test that, okay? One. Two. Three. Oh, it is three. The guy in the, the, guy in the YouTube video that I was watching, he fired one, two, three as well, and it took him like five to get it. I don't know what the hell his problem was, but thank you guys for the tip. I'll definitely have enough missiles to do this now. I don't know how the rest of the puzzle actually goes. I didn't watch that far, and... Do these guys just home in on me or something? Or they just go around down there? Okay, if they just... If they hang out down there, I don't need to worry about them, but they're... Okay, I'll let them do their thing. Alright, well... These guys are in the way, but hopefully they don't deter me from blowing this up. Two, three. One, two, 
three. I'm worried it like it's gonna hit this guy and ruin my missile shot. Not that I have to worry that much, but. Okay. Another wave down. Move on to the next one. Ow! What the hell hit me? Whatever. Can't see this one with the darn. There we go. Is that the last one? I think that was the last one. Hold on, let me scan this bad boy. Wave Buster. Okay. Let's see what this thing is that you guys have been telling me it's amazing. Let's see. Wave Buster acquired. This powerful attack uses missiles while active. Using the wave beam, press and hold A to charge, and then press Y to fire. Hold A for continuous fire. Additional data. Let me see what the data says. Let's examine this thing. Um, arm cannon, wave beam? No, it's probably something else. Uh, some interesting settings over here. HUD lag. Oh, there's a hint system. I've been I've, I've been using the hint system, and I can't even find my way half the time. That's embarrassing. Um, let's see. So I the wave using the wave beam. Press charge hold and then click triangle. Oh wow. Okay. Uh, so I can tell where that was going. I could have held it down longer, but. So it's basically just like a super strong, like continuous beam of energy that you can use to blast the shit out of stuff. Now, someone tell me what the application of that would be. Is it probably going to be for like some sort of boss fight coming up that's going to help a lot or what? Um, obviously, <laughs> the obvious implications being it's very powerful. So I, I get that much. Um, but yeah, is it going to help out like a lot for like, some sort of enemy or boss fight coming up? And these guys just spawn back. That's so stupid. Yeah, cool. I finally finished that tower. No more uh, comments about that. Not that it bothered me. Like, there was just like everyone wanted me to finish that tower. So I got it. I got the power up. I can move on. Let's go. Uh, where should we go next? Should probably look for some relics. I think I might look for some relics and then along the way look for power ups. I think it might be a productive episode. I don't even need to fight you. You're not worth my time. All right, let's see. Let's see what the next uh, logbook artifacts. Let's see if we can find uh, strength. The heat of the magmore was a test for many warriors. A shrine in their honor holds the artifact of strength. I don't really want to go back to the magmore caverns right now, so let's see what else we can find. Uh, Collapse it to reveal the chamber where the artifact of Elder is held. That's one option. We can go to the drifts. Uh, let's see. Some of these I don't have scanned, I guess. Interesting. In one of the Talon's far corners, a grove of life lies. Reveal the pillar beneath the waves to find the artifact of Chozo. The grove of life in Talon's. So I'm guessing Talon Overworld. We're not there. Let's go. Let's go look at Talent Overworld real fast. The gro one of the corners. Okay. So where would a corner be? Is it like in here? In here? Grove of Life. 
Grove of Life. What would that possibly be? In here, maybe? It's probably up there. Yeah, I don't know if I can reach that yet. Um, I can't reach that room yet. There's no power to the door. Let's see what another artifact location could be. Sorry if this is not interesting to you guys, but it's interesting to me. I love uh, trying to solve puzzles. <clears throat> In one of the talents for our corners... Okay, that's one we just read. Why are there some of these question marks? World. Uh, within the ruins of our ho home, we honor our fallen elders in the Great Hall. A chamber beneath the statue holds the artifact of the world. Okay, so I'm guessing green is the hint, so hall. In the Chozo ruins. Okay, so we're in the Chozo ruins. Let's see if there's a hall somewhere. Something named hall. Vault access, sun tower. It's not up there. Watery hall. Okay, there's the hall right there. Okay, well, that seems pretty self explanatory. So the hall is where I'm gonna go. There's also the gathering hall. See if there's any other halls that I don't know about, so I don't uh, go to the wrong one. Hall of the Elders. Didn't I already get that one though? Hold on, let's let's reread this puzzle. Uh, was it Chozo? No. World. Fallen Elders in a Great Hall. chamber beneath the statue so is that the one that was like bowling that I went bowling with where he like you jump in and it rolls you it's probably that one uh, a tall cave stands at Fendora's Fendrana's edge seek the, see, uh, I can't read her now seek the unseen entrance at its top to find okay I kind of want to go to Fendrana drifts because I think that there's two places there already there's spirit and then there's a uh, No, wait, hold on. Spirit and... Where was the other one? There was another one. Yeah, Fendrana. Okay, so let's go to Fendrana Drifts. Sorry for not being very productive, guys. I'm just trying to figure this out. Uh, Fendrana Drifts. Let's see if there's any exit that takes us there. Probably not. Really unfortunate. Um, we could go to the overworld. Hold on, let me go to the overworld. Is there any places the drifts there? Probably not. Damn it. Okay, well, I gotta go to the Magmore Caverns, I guess. While we're there, I guess we'll look for the Magmore one. Why not? The, the Magmore Caverns are just so huge, though. This is gonna suck. To the mines we go, I guess. Or caverns, not mines. Probably scan around this room now. Think about it. Oh shit! Hmm. Yeah, I should probably scan. Let me do a little quick uh, look around. Doubt there's anything important in here, but hold up now. Have I been in this thing before? Probably. Let's just go in there again. Oh, I have not been in there. Good thing I went in there. Missile expansion acquired. All right. That was pretty cool. I like missile expansions.
All right, this is probably a room I also missed some stuff in. Let's just take a look around. Probably didn't miss it too much, actually. It was like forever ago that we did the boss fight in here. Pretty crazy. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Probably some secret stuff in here too, now I think about it. Probably some double jump stuff. Like, this is very strange that this is here. Why would that be there? Oh, it's probably just a shortcut to get up so you don't have to use these elevators. That makes sense. Okay, uh, just making sure. Don't want to go anywhere else. Okay, here we go. We're going to go down to the Magmore Mines again. Magmore Caverns. Should probably double up reading on the Magmore uh, thing. It's some sort of shrine I'm looking for down here. First, let's see where the Drift's exit is. Uh, it's gonna be... Okay, it's way over there. Let's take a look for the shrine along the way. Um, I don't think... For some reason, I feel like the shrine isn't gonna be in this area, but... Looking for any sort of shrine room title. <laughs> Doubt that would be an actual thing, but. Alright, well, let's just. Let me read up on the. Logbook. Artifacts. Okay. Heat of the Magmore was tested many warriors. A shrine in their honor holds the artifact of strength. Hmm. I think that's the only one in the mines, too, and this. I don't know why these aren't, like, scanned. I hope I didn't miss them at the place. I'm gonna have to go back there. Uh, someone let me know if I actually need to go back and scan more of those statues. Hold up now. <laughs> now I'm all paranoid. Is like, is there something in this room or not? In this case, there's not. Remember back when we couldn't even get through this place? Like, because of the heat? Now we have a purple suit, we can swim underwater faster, we got a bunch of missiles, we got weapons for days. Got the spider ball. None of these rooms are very shrine looking to me, so we should just should be fine. Nonetheless, I guess I'll just scan. Someone said that you can also use the ice beam to take out these guys better? Oh my god, yes. Okay. Thank you guys. That was a helpful hint right there. Ice beam just wrecks the Magmore guys. Before I jump over there, let that go away. Okay. I don't know why I just jumped like that. Whatever. Ow, this is like obnoxiously bright orange. Holy shit. I just being pretty cool. I wish it fired faster, but in terms of a weapon, it's actually kind of nice. Immobilizes enemies and whatnot. Maybe that's why it fires slow. That makes sense to me. Maybe this is some sort of shrine. Cool if I could destroy those, but I guess not.
Huh. Well, I'll find it eventually. At least I don't have to go down in that little room anymore with the double jump. That's the only thing that sucks about this thing, because you can fire so slowly that it trying to hit someone with it, it's kinda Alright. Grab your health. This room's gotta have a secret in it. It's just gotta, it's way too massive. Hmm. Okay, well. Let's just keep heading toward our direction. This way. God damn it. I don't know if I'll ever get good at the platforming in this game. It's my own fault. Too used to dual stick uh, controls. Not that the controls in this game are bad, don't jump at me. They're actually pretty good. This room could also probably have something in it as well. But not be surprised, to be honest. Okay. Oh, uh, there's also this room I never got to access up there. You see that top room? Maybe now's the time. Now is the time I acquire that room. Let's go, uh, let's go find out. Oh, the, the turrets are gone. Maybe they're not gone, they're just on the other side or something, but I don't see them anywhere. That's very odd. Huh. Of all enemies that don't spawn back, I find it odd that this room, this room's turrets are the one. So the door is up there, it looks like. I can probably get to that. My newfound double jump. Oh, I can also get up there, probably. Ooh. Ooh. Secret stuff. Or not secret stuff, just more areas. Let's go. Oh, yeah. I'm digging this. Okay, let's start scanning. Requires power. I can offer you some power. Let's find that... Wait, okay. Let's find some sort of a... Uh, power station. Hold on. Okay, I don't... What, what's the bridge that says it's down? It's over here? Over here, maybe? Huh. Oh! Okay. I'm an idiot. There's this thing just chilling here. Oh, do I have to use the, uh... There we go. Cool. We're making discoveries, guys. We're making discoveries. If I had to guess, this is going to be where the uh, artifact is. There it is! But I'm going to have to fight the stupid guardians again, so let's, uh, let's get ready for that. It can't be this easy. I'm getting some Indiana Jones vibes from this shit. Just sitting on the pedestal ready for me to take, but the second I try to go for it, booby trap. Alright, well, let's do it. Da -na -na -na, da -na -na. Oh, I just grabbed it. Okay. Cool. 
It was that easy. I'm surprised this wasn't guarded by those uh, ghost guys. Uh, question, does this room have any sort of secret stuff? Portion of area unstable. This area? Or does this mean in general like this thing is falling apart? I don't know. I'll try one more super missile. Don't think it's gonna do anything, but yeah. All right, well, let me know if I missed anything in this room, guys. I don't think I did, but. Cool, we got one of the artifacts, very nice. Got some enemies again. Oh, shit, wrong view. Okay. me thank you uh, let's see I'm not thinking that I missed anything per se let's drop down here all right well, let's just head on over to the uh, Fenderana drifts town of world west drifts right there okay I don't think I went the right way, did I? Oh, I did. I'm just gonna go up there. <laughs> I'm taking way too long doing this. I'm sorry, guys. Well, that was cool. Got one of the artifacts pretty easily. That was one of the easier artifacts so, so far. There was no guardians or anything. I guess there was, like, some guys in jetpacks and stuff, but they even got rid of the turrets. Oh, I'm gonna... Damn it. Here's that secret that's still eluding me, and I just can't get the timing right. Okay, ooh. Oh, baby, come on now. Oh my god, I am so freaking awesome. Energy tank acquired. Oh, baby. That made me happy to get that. Wow. That was, you guys know, I, t I told myself a while back I'd eventually get that little bastard. Didn't know what was up there. But, <laughs> we got it. For all this time. That was a pretty productive trip down in the Magbor Mines. Caverns, whatever. Let's hope we can say the same about the drifts. There's two relics to get here. Hopefully a lot more power-ups as well. I know there's a lot of frozen, like, ice stuff here that have a lot of power-ups in them. Hopefully I can find those again. Okay. So... Let's see. Artifacts. Let's take a look at what they were again. Uh, a tower sits atop their fortress, collapsed it, collapsed it to reveal the chamber where the artifact of Elder is held. So if I'm not mistaken, this is probably their fortress over there. And there is a statue inside, so let's go take a look at that. Can't get up this way. That's fine. Nope, don't want to use missiles. Do I? Oh, I forgot I have to use missiles to kill those guys. That's odd. Hey, drop missiles. That, that works out to me. Um, jumped up to here. Over here. Jump 
worn and weathered. Um, doubt there's anything behind it. Yeah, there's no power conduit behind it. Okay, so here's that statue, or maybe it's this one, maybe it's a different one, I don't know. Plane of existence. It's either this one or the one farther down into the, into the fortress. Because this one doesn't look like I, I can destroy it super easily, I don't know. Um, I can try putting bombs on his plate, on his plane of his plane of existence. Yeah, that's gonna do anything. This is the statue I was thinking about. Um, okay, so I think this is the thing I can destroy. Hold on. If I'm not mistaken, I can maybe destroy this with a super missile. Hold on. Pretty sure this is the statue that it wants me to destroy. We checked the uh, logs. Elder. A tower sits atop their fortress, collapse it to reveal the chamber where the artifact of Elder is held. Only reason I think it's here, because I can actually scan all this random crap. Like, why else would that let me scan this? I'm gonna try one more time. I'm gonna just fire at his hands, though. Huh. Odd. Very odd. Maybe it's in the chapel? I doubt it though. Isn't that where I fought the boss or something? Can I destroy that? Oh, I gotta go down here. This is probably the most boring episode ever for you guys. I'm sorry. I haven't really done that much. And I didn't... I missed one of the things to destroy down here. I'm an idiot. Okay, let's go in here. I think I've already got everything in here, but... Yeah, this is pointless. Alright, let's just get on out of here. There is another uh, drifts thing we can go look for right now. I might try to do that. Another relic in this area. Okay, so the other one was located... Uh, Hmm. 
Nope, not like ever. Nope, not that one. Spirit. Uh, a tall cave stands at the Fendara's edge. Fendrana's edge. Seek the unseen entrance at its top to find the artifact of spirit. A tall cave at the edge. Okay. Tall cave at the edge. Where would the edge be? Over here? A tall cave. At its edge. Maybe in there? Hold on, before I go running. Yeah, might as well try this place. Vendrana's Edge. Or like, in that area. I'll read this one more time. A tall cave stands at- okay. Yeah, let's go try to find that thing. Alright, so that to get there, I'm gonna have to go do, 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 up top. Okay, it's not very far. We go there, try to grab it, and then uh come back and save. That'll probably be the end of the episode. It's gonna be a little longer episode than normal. It's gonna be probably over an hour, but that's fine. Uh, exit would be up here. Ignore you guys, you're not worth my time. And the exit is all the way over there to the right. Okay, let's go see if we can find this uh, relic. Artifact. Whatever it's called. <laughs> we'll probably never get the names right. Probably have to get up there with a half pipe. What the hell got me stuck on something down here? Huh, wait a second. Very odd. I think it's implying that I'm supposed to go like up that wall, but the walls are very uneven here. See, they like they kind of like bump me off. I can't get a, I can't get a direct like. Not to mention, it keeps getting me stuck on nothing down here. See, I, I keep like landing down there and it keeps bumping me, like it just stops my momentum. Okay, I don't know if I'm doing this wrong, but let's go get a better view. See, this is easy, I can just go up here and do this. Or maybe this is where I have to get my, mem my momentum in the first place. I don't freaking know. Oh god, this is... This is weird. Alright, I'm certainly high enough to get to it now, but unfortunately, I can't get over there.
Oh, baby, I'm so freaking close. Okay. To be persistent for once, give this a good, good fair shake. If I look like an idiot for 10 minutes, then so freaking be it. Problem is, when I get over there to try to attempt it. This is the only reliable spot to build up momentum is back here, because the other walls are just too narrow. Oh my god, that freaking rock hit me. This is so annoying. Alright, well, I, I'm i going to wait for you guys to tell me some advice or something on that section, because I'm just going to drive myself wild trying to get up there. Um, let's make our way back to the save station. Wow. The Chozos seem like very interesting people. I have to do some reading up on them in the off time. Alright, well, let's just go save, I guess. Still a pretty productive episode. I got a lot of stuff done. Sun Tower is defeated. Um, yeah, a lot of things like that. Uh, yeah, as always, feel free to leave me comments as to, like, tips as to what to do next. Uh, I've asked repeatedly throughout this episode if you guys just help. Um, so I'm looking forward to that. And until next time, this has been Mighty Gazelle. I hope you all have a mighty day. See you guys.